What's good, YouTube? Dre here with Different Gaming. Going to be bringing you guys a deck profile. Um, I've been running tier, uh, of course. Um, but I've been doing the the hero build, and I'm here to bring my personal opinion about it. So, as y'all all know, I have been I've been on the King of the Swamp package, big. Um, always felt like that build was more promising, um, like just more powerful uh, plays that you can do with the King of the Swamp compared to the hero build. Now, the hero build is very rewarding, but there's a lot more dead draws. There's, there's really no, you know, there's no forward point to it, and the names are just just iffy names at the in the in the hero build because your your only target is you hope that you hit the heroes Nessie and your darks to make mud dragon. After like after playing some locals and you know really trying to figure the deck out, um, learning the lines that the deck offers you, um, this build sucks. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get right into it and explain why, in my opinion, this build sucks. Uh, two Rhino Heart, uh, one each of the names, three Terra Cash. Um, I don't run three, three Rhino Heart because Night Sword of Serpent serves as the third Rhino Heart. Great meal, great chain block. I'll never change this. Um, all this is very standard. Uh, the Shizu cards, standard. Uh, Drew's Worm, Ball Drake. Shout out to my boy Chris. Uh, he he put me on Ball Drake. I was doing Magnum Mutt and Drew was Worm, and he he was like, "Well, what purpose does Magnum Mutt serve besides adding a dragon? You know, Ball Drake. If I have Mud Dragon, um, I could just chain Mud Dragon called Light Dark, ascend it. So that this was really good. Shout out shout out to my boy Chris. Uh, Beast, Destrudo for the Darks, Destrudo for the Barone play. The worst card is that actually draw in your hand. Um, I can't, I can't tell you how many times I had double Mally in hand. Um, the deck, and I don't play the Horus package either. Um, I don't agree with the Horus package. Like, yes, it's rewarding, but it it just loses to so many hand traps. And it's, it just skips your turn. Um, yeah. Uh, I do do the danger package. The danger package is actually better than a hero package. Um, shout out to Solemn Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, I seen his top eight. And I, um, I seen he used the Jackalope. Um, I've been debating on using another danger. I um, just wasn't sure which one. So, Jackalope ensures a body. And there's been too many uh, occurrences where I have Mothman and I'm really gambling at that point. Uh, two Noob. Um... It's very bricky and cloggy at three. So you want to see it, but you don't want to see it. Uh, for the spells, three Pearl Rhino, two Scream, self-explanatory. Uh, Foolish Burial Goods, Foolish Burial, called by for the one offs Then two Talents, three Super Poly. This has been a killer combo. And the 
in for the traps. Trevor Carmen Menonoise to Selyuk. Self-explanatory. Um, a lot of players are taking Menonoise out. Menonoise is too good not to play, especially with Dro and Ash being very, um, very prominent in this format. So, Menonoise is a great way to play around Dro. Uh, for the extra deck, one Barone, uh, Barricade Board, Spren, Dark, MVP, Abyss Dweller, Tom Thief, Bahama Shark Toad Package, Beatrice, Zeus, Zeus, shout out, shout out to my boy Tobias, um, I did take this package out, and then he was like, you should definitely play that, like, there's a lot of tier players taking us out, and it's, it's too good, uh, for the fusions, Dangerous, Garura, Mud Dragon, Draco Stapelia, Kaleido. Now, Terramins are supposed to be fusion based. So, with only five fusions to go into, the the deck isn't doing what it's what it, what it was built to do. It was built to fusion summon. So, only five targets for fusion summoning just isn't good. Like you basically just use your fusions to try to link climb or get into Beatrice. Um, so that's, that's the profile. Um, that's what I've been running, what's what I've been testing. Um, definitely won't be going back to this build. Um, I will be going to either Beast King or King of the Swamp, so. Thank y'all for tuning in. Hope y'all enjoy the profile. And as always, peace.